Hobie's Knives of China Water Jet Cutty, William Hobie Smith, 2016. I have started a new company, Hobie's Knives of China, and here we're cutting out our first blade blanks for the Blade Show in Atlanta this June. Now, I am the author of Backyard Deer Hunting, and we've been dealing with knives for 20 years or more. And now, we're cutting our own first patterns. I'm Hobie Smith with Hobie's Outdoor Adventures, and we are talking to Jim Porter, who is the founder and president of Atlanta Water Jet in Beaufort, Georgia. And Jim has just got through cutting our first sheet of knives that we're going to be marketing under Hobie's Knives of China. And here is a more complete look at the set and our new logo. Jim, what caused you to get started in this business? Well, the water jet always intrigued me, and uh, I was in commercial construction and saw that industry going not a particular way that I cared for, and uh, decided to try something new. Well, new this is, and useful. What water jet cutting does, it allows you to take a piece of metal and cut it without the application of heat or stress on the edges you're cutting. Uh, this is vital if you're doing something like I am, that is blade making, where you don't want these edges to have different strength or temper or hardness characteristics to the west of the blade. If the edge does, it will be because something you did to it rather than because of the mechanics of the processes. Uh, for example, in laser cutting, etc., etc., uh, there's no way you can avoid getting some disturbance in the brain structure on these thin edges as you go through and cut them. And certainly with typical forging techniques, yeah, same thing. You put stress and grain on the steel, just in the apps of forging. And even in centering or such things as lost wax casting, well, you get a more uniform product, but for some purposes, it doesn't do all that well. Uh, lost wax does not do well for knife blades, for example. So, uh, Jim, how long have you been at this stuff? Uh, Twelve years now. Wow. Now, although you are have Atlanta in your name, you are somewhat removed from the city. I trust that was by design. Oh, yes. There's uh, five and a half million people here in Metro Atlanta, and we're we were at one time on the very outskirts, but mm -hmm. uh, it's rolling this way. Yes, sir, it is. Uh, any plans for expansion elsewhere? What are you going to say right here? Uh, we're looking to open uh, out west uh, another, another store. Good. Well, we look forward to hearing from that. And in the meantime, thank you very much for the very excellent job that you've done with our knives. Well, you're welcome. We really Glad appreciate it. Glad we could help out. We've just, for example, got through cutting several of my favorite. And this is the little knife I call the caterer's friend. A really little all-purpose knife for a caterer with a small hand. Yeah, it is. And the feature of it is that round grip in the back fits in the palm of the hand. And that way the knife does not twist in the work and you have absolute control of it. The flat blade allows you to use it as a spatula or to cut with. The straight point, you can scrape with it, you can stir with it, or anything else. So it's a very versatile knife that you can operate in one hand. I offer that in two grinds. One, a straight grind, where it's ground only on one side, and the double grind version you see there. But that should be one of our more popular knives. Atlanta is a huge metropolitan area, and from here, from this center, well, uh, you can serve and ship anywhere in the world, can you not? Yes, uh, we ship nationwide every day. Yes, sir. I'm sure you have cut some very unusual stuff besides my little knife blades. <laughs> uh, what are some of those things that you've tackled? Oh, we've, they're too numerous. To, uh, we, we've cut uh, seven inch aluminum, six inch steel, uh, all for different uh, industries, mm -hmm. uh, OEMs, other machine shops, uh, hobbyists, knife makers, and electrical engineers, artists, uh, uh, 
Anything you can design and steal, you can cut it. Is that, is that what you're telling me? Yes. Okay. Now, if someone wishes to contact you and place an order for something or consult with you about a particular run of some object or other, uh, how do they do that? Uh, they can, uh, one, go to our website, atlantawaterjet.com, uh, email sales at atlantawaterjet.com, and or our phone number is 678-714-8008. For now, this is Hobie Smith, reminding you to hunt what you eat and eat what you hunt. Be legal, be ethical, be safe, goodbye, God bless, and see you next time. So these are some of the unique things that we'll be bringing out with Hobie's Knives of China. And here is the contact information for Atlanta Waterjet in Buford, Georgia. Here are my outdoor books, and I have chapters on knives on all of these books, and I've been writing and using outdoor blades for all oh, 50 years or better. And I also have a new series of business books under the Profit brand. Now, this business, Hobie's Knives of China, is actually one of these businesses I'm bringing out my newest book is Ideas for New Businesses on how you can start your own million or billion dollar business and a little blurb about that. The blanks that you've just seen cut are going to be available at the International Blade Show at the Cobb Galleria on June 3 through 5 at table 16U. Now, if you can't make it to the show, I'll also have a Kickstarter project starting within days, and you'll be able to get these blanks as a re reward for your pledge to my Kickstarter. Good hunting and good eating from the outdoors. Goodbye, and God bless.